So now we have now we can begin on the toggle focus rocket. Yeah, sweet. Nice. So this feature stuff, I'm going to um, visit a snippet. It's the um, feature, and I'm going to remove these. Mm -hmm. I guess maybe we should make it. Uh, are we going to repeat this whole test case? Like inserting the test and so on? Could we have it when I insert a test? But we have some uh, some of these. Um, this one it already has deferred. Yeah, okay, they are all different. Okay. I will we'll defer it to later. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> that wall was the quickie binding for deferring stuff. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to copy all this then. So there's toggle focus rocket feature. I love how you fixed your snippet so you could copy paste. Yeah, I know. Paste. It was uh, now it's nice. Yeah. Even if I don't use it right away. Toggle focus rocket, please. Uh, so this one is we'll just get that one. Focus test. Focus test. Toggle focus. And you also have to enable the buster mode. Yeah, you're right. And uh, do we want the space here? Yeah. yeah. So if I touch this file, it should run only with focus. Yeah, nice. Mm -hmm. But uh, it's still, it's passing. Then oh. I should not see. That's uh, oh, I should not got see. Got the it. test wrong. So yeah, should fix it. yeah, that would be. There we go. Yep. This I can fix. Nice. So I have a sneaky suspicion this is going to be easy. <laughs> yeah, just <laughs> fixing it like that should be pretty easy. <laughs> you don't even need that one. Uh, no, right? Because so toggle. Focus. Focus rocket. Yeah, right. Okay, so go to current test, looking at, and then, okay, so this is, uh, this seems very similar. Yeah, you're going to need some key findings too. Yeah, right, so that wasn't actually the problem. So, uh, focus, toggle. Okay, so it's passing. Yep. I'll just quickly go ahead and fix, it, fix this problem. Yeah. Uh, do you have a suggestion for a name? So, I'm thinking that this should uh, not be an interactive function and it should take uh, some kind of. Uh, Prefix? Yeah, yeah, right, okay. So, uh, toggle, test name. Prefix. Okay. Is that yeah. doable? Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. Uh, prefix, and then we'll just do length. Does length support both lists and strings? I'm, I wonder if it's len for strings. I'm not sure. Uh, let's see. Length. Yeah. Vector list string. Sounds good. Length. Okay. Yes. So this one will just say uh, buster toggle test name prefix. Swoosh. Nice. Wonderful. Maybe even do that. Yeah. It's gonna screw up the tests. It's gonna. Can I fix it? Yeah. Um. No. <laughs> Too much work. <laughs> Too much work. There we go. I'll, uh, I'm going to do that. Um, I'm going to do this. And this, and please replace that with... No, yeah, but... <laughs> Actually, what I was thinking is that if you add the 
slash this in by hand and you don't include space, it would be nice if it was it was able to turn them off. Yeah, right. I'm, I'm, I agree, and that has to be true about a focus rocket too. Yeah, I guess so. Okay, so basically what we're saying is that the prefix may be followed by any number of strings, uh, spaces. Yeah. Blur test. <laughs> Humor is fun. Yeah, it is. <laughs> so uh, I I actually wrote the last test, but okay, who cares? <laughs> I'll make it easy on you then. This one works too. Why? Um, I turn. I should not see. No, it's, it's sure because it's just removing the rocket. It doesn't really care about the space. Should not see, right? Yeah, of course, because you you refactor it, so it's uh, of no? course it's work. It's working. No? Blur test should be working. Yeah, that test should be working. Yeah. 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 So I'm, I just wrote a test that's working. I would blur test even when you, uh, user doesn't appreciate the <laughs> space ciness of. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I have not the space at the end. Yeah. Like this. Like uh, that. Yeah. Then I should not see that. So that's going to fail. Yeah. Cool. So I'll fix that. Um, so we'll start by not including the spaces here. Yep. And then we'll do here if we're looking at prefix delete car. So now we actually. Okay. So I'm just gonna flip this. If we're not looking at the prefix. I think if else in Emacs is a little bit strange. Yeah. So, so we'll do that, and then we can just uh, have multiple else statements yeah. down here. Yeah. And, and should have the space at the end of the insert. Yeah. Right. Insert takes multiple arguments, so you don't have to concat anything. You don't have to concat. It takes multiple. Oh, it takes, oh sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I heard the opposite thing. Exactly. Right, so um, uh, we start by deleting the character, and next up we want to uh, while look, so I'm I'm going overkill at this point. It's okay. Yeah. So while we're looking at a space, we're gonna kill it. Uh, delete. Part one. Yeah. Right. So I think that should be it. Oh, <laughs> horrible, horrible. So uh, did you kill the stack or something like that? Invalid read syntax. You have some a superfluous parenthesis. Oh, right. Yeah. It works. Nice. Uh, so what would? Yeah. Okay. So we added. We added a feature. Yeah. Okay. Um, you did like uh, this. Uh, C C C B. Toggle focus. Uh, toggle focus. Rocket test. Okay. Very nice. 